Hello friends, welcome to my channel. In this video, we are going to discuss again a new project idea for final year computer science students. And this project idea, you can implement again, uh, whatever project we discuss, topic we discuss, uh, those can be implemented in any of the languages, uh, either in ASP.NET, PHP, Python. So in this video, we are again going to discuss a new uh, project idea that you can use uh, to implement or you can use for your final year uh, project. So let us start the video. If you are coming first time to this channel, please click on the subscribe button so that you get important updates whenever a new video is uploaded on the channel. So today's topic will be, uh, it will be very much similar to what uh, you have been doing in your colleges. So that will, again, it will be easier for you to explain the problem statement and the way uh, you can uh, improve the current system. So uh, we are going to uh, talk about academic performance of students. So in every school college, uh, this is a must that uh, there should be a system through which uh, we can monitor, we can uh, check the performance of the students. So the idea how you can implement is uh, this particular academic performance is by using the fuzzy logic method. So you can utilize the fuzzy logic method to implement the academic performance. And if we talk about the parameters that will be required to implement this academic performance will be uh, the attendance of the student. Then what uh, all internal evaluation uh, that is being done so all his internal marks and then uh, whatever marks he got uh, in external i mean whenever the copies are sent to the external evaluators so they check it so these will be the three parameters that will be used to evaluate the final academic performance of the student the idea behind this fuzzy logic method uh, is this particular method for evaluating the student is much more accurate than the conventional technique. So it's very important that uh, the evaluation system should be foolproof. There should not be any error. So that's why like uh, I suggest to use this fuzzy logic method. And now the very, very important thing once you are implementing this, the data entry part where you are going to enter all these things like the attendance of the student, uh, whatever internal marks he has obtained. So all those information it should be correct because again, it is all depend, uh, all the uh, performance of the student or career of the student is totally dependent upon this particular uh, system. So if the system is faulty, then again, it will be a problem. So correct information should be there and there, there should be proper testing and then only uh, you, can, you will be having a good and uh, solid system through which uh, the it can be, I mean, once you will uh, show this to your guide, uh, you need to convince him because again, if it is implemented there, that will be a very good thing. So this is uh, all about the today's uh, project idea for uh, computer science students. Friends, if you like this video, please uh, like, share and subscribe. And thank you for watching this video.